so it's probably been about an hour and a half. I, uh, since I was getting all splashed around, didn't expect that to happen. Definitely gonna wear some eye protection next time, but since it got all over me, I decided to cut my hair. Um, first time for the, I think for the whole summer. Everybody else, I make sure the boys' hairs are cut. Um, of course, the dog, and I'm way last on the list, but that's all good. Uh, so I'm, I'm a little nervous. I haven't uh, looked at the chicken yet. Uh, I just, just walked outside, so I'm out to go over to the chicken and see, just see how the mood of the chicken is. I mean, my biggest, my biggest problem this year, I haven't really had much time to focus on Damn, the sun is bright. I haven't had much time to focus on the the chickens. That was my intention, not to focus on them this year, and to really just kind of let them let them vibe out. But you know, they they have shown me where that wasn't the best philosophy um, at times. But it's been going it's been going okay, and I think we're midway through. I don't expect any major differences or hiccups in the situation. Uh, I feel like I got it under control. Um, but you know things happen so with this uh, the real reason that I, I jumped in uh, last week I remember and, and I, I it's just me and my, my normal walk around routine I saw the chicken kind of to, to, to herself and you know just from a social standpoint that's that's not as normal um, and then on her the top top back she had looked kind of like stiff like she was never she was just like real tight so um, I didn't do the full uh, bath like I did uh, but I did catch a video I, I researched it real quick uh, I think that's the same chicken that since she was a, a little chick she always would have that um, that thing um, on her butt It'd always be like a little poop left on there uh, so it is what it is. I, I I care about the chickens in a sense that we're in a partnership. So if that's the difference between me giving the chicken a, a, a better, more beneficial, productive life, then I'm all for it. I didn't like I said I didn't expect to get splashed in my eye, but hey, it has come with this territory. That's all I got to say. So you know I don't want to take too much. I'm gonna go. I'm a little nervous, but I, I think I'm hopeful that most of the interventions that I've done, uh, they're, they're thought out enough that I'm, I'm closer to respecting a good result. So we'll see. Um, I'm going to just take this and go and film that. I mean, if I had to say it looks a little better. Just the fact that she's in the front of the fence and not in the back, like trying to hide. Uh, she's near the food. She's still a little wet, so that's probably a little uncomfortable. But this is it. I can't say what I was expecting, because at this point, um, she seems to be chilling. Um, she's, she's in the sun, at least. So she's conscious of needing to dry off but like how would you feel if you don't really like the water you don't find yourself ever in the water and somebody just took you for a, a 10 minute swim uh so we'll give us some more time and see how that how it plays out but so far i still feel confident that my intervention makes makes sense and hopefully Hopefully I wasn't too late in trying to rectify the situation of whatever was going on. A couple of hours later and she seems, you know, she's, she's still not leaving the run. But um, she looks mostly dry, almost 100% dry. Um, and I seen her walking, walking around more than she was uh, before, prior. So, you know, I'll just keep monitoring it. I did notice. Uh, they were out of water, so I went and took care of the water, added some apple cider vinegar, um, I believe um, a tablespoon per per gallon, one tablespoon per gallon, and uh, 
It gave us some, some grains that usually I soak them in water and then put them in there. But I just filled up another tub with the water um, in the grains. So hopefully that's like, you know, a lot of nutrients. I didn't see a go for it. She almost went for it, but you know, it'll, it'll, it'll come, I think, tomorrow, later on today and then tomorrow. But I did notice something that one of the other chickens uh, was hanging around um, her. So there is, um, so why I'm alarmed or triggered and why I think this situation is something that is worth my attention uh, is mainly because she she looks defenseless and I let the chickens free range often so being defenseless or just not willing to uh, move appropriately that's probably gonna cause a safety issue uh, for the other chicken so at least it was good to see one chicken which I think is the one I call Tyson uh, I think which she gets a little aggressive because I don't have roosters anymore but um, she does she's the leader of the pack and, and bullies everybody in the pecking order but for some reason today she's hanging around the run even though there's a ton of places that the chicken could go about I mean it's probably in the back here it's probably like a half acre for the chicken and there's enough spots bushes that the chicken could go in but she she ain't leaving a run for some reason maybe it was hydration uh, we'll see uh, all I could tell is that the other chickens are having a normal active day and she's she didn't start the day off like that and if you pair that with what I experienced last week um, you know seeing the 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 poop the the, the poop sticking that's that's why I, I jumped into action a few moments later at this point uh, I've been going hard pretty much all day uh, very active and kind of beat um, nothing to do with the the chicken, the hen that I've been watching over, but just everything um, together. So I, I'm gonna do one last look, see how she's doing. Um, slow progress. I've seen a lot of slow, slow progress, but progress nonetheless. So uh, thanks for hanging on with me. Sorry, my my energy is a little. <laughs> I'm not as upbeat as I was earlier, but um, that's, you know, sometimes the long days, they're, they're worth it, get a lot done, and yeah, hopefully, hopefully you enjoy.